Okay, welcome everyone. Uh, long time no see. About a uh, huge series going on in the Pandora's box turning the Boyd one. Um, big shout out to Boyd for making another uh, huge turning. And. We will be here watching uh, Grass and Groom against um, Count Von Count. This is a best of five series. There we go. First game is mega random. This will also get uploaded on YouTube. Be sure to check that out! Exclamation mark YouTube. So, oh yeah, let's see. Okay. Okay. Let me count one count in the left in the blue color playing as set and grass and on the right side playing as Zeus. Another Greek against Eggy. I have to fix that. Uh, grass and groom is in the red. He's going Zeus. Count one count is uh, set in the blue. I hope everything is fixed and fine. There we go. Um, best of five series start right away. Count von Count already used his uh, vision, god power, getting the the center of the map revealed for him. His priest is idle. I don't like this. And look at this gold mine. This gold mine can proxy be a thing arrest right away. And on the other side of the map, more standard uh, standard build order for Grass Agrum IC5, 3 probably next to on uh, gold, but check this out. Already Grass Agrum is going on this hunt that he saw, and Count is already converting even one of those could get a little bit uh, of uh, more resources for count and he gets bolded right away nice I like this from grass and groom nice he didn't get value out of those boars and out of his priest in general so this um, it's huge so everyone uh, can use uh, uh, new emojis, new emotes in this channel. I modified it specifically for you guys. Hi Goraki, everyone. Um, so Count is already going for a temple. 
Um, I don't think this is an early advance. Maybe it's a 4... 15, 4, 16 advance, maybe. On the other side, Grassigrim will start his temple. I would like to see where he would put it. Okay, he's going to the back. This can also give Grass and Groom, as I said before, the option to go for Athenaras. If the mic uh, is too loud, please, please be so kind to tell me. As, in a, as I am in a setup away from uh, home. So look at this. <laughs> look at this. Edgy at its finest. What is this count? Anyway, Count wants to go for uh, 430, Pta. And Grass is going for an early hero. Maybe getting him on the hunt. Um, he needs to drop off. I don't like this. He's uh, delaying so much his advance time. It's gonna be late. Uh, maybe it's gonna be five minutes, something like this. And Hermes is the god of choice, and he's splitting them on gold and wood. So I see him going for um, for a second. To see, he count has a low HP villi there, but I don't think. Uh, that he will have any trouble with him. He's so far fine, 93%. And Pta is out. Oh, and we have three priests and the Pharaoh. This is gonna be huge. This is gonna be huge. Oh, he misclicked on the Granary. He didn't do that. He's going in the front. He saw the hero in the back. So, he's just putting on the aggression on the other end, and Crassigrum now gets the center. This wood line is abusable. Let's see. The map is like wood in the side. Oh, no, 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 he lost a villi. Already that's huge for count. Um, down to 18 vils for uh, Crassigrum. Um, I think uh, stream is fine. I'm not dropping any frames and everything is good. So, so also he boosts grass of gold. Grass and groom is going for this DC and the water is coming right here on the other side. I think uh, Count lost a villi, but at the same time, he can get those. Yes, he got the shifting sounds of the town center. Maybe forcing the ceasefire now. Now Count is uh, way ahead. Count is way ahead. He's building a barracks. He's uh, he's getting a monument out. This map has so much hunt. This mega random spawn. So this. Uh, town center proxy secured with a wall here. Proxy secures this gold mine. I like this. And count is also going for a second TC. I mean, this is the right thing to do. Wanting to match. Whatever. Um, grass is going. Grass is going for stable. I would like to see also an archer range being thrown down at some point. And probably a storehouse. On the back in the back so because this is kind of usable so the two heroes will spot the TC they need to go back so the centaur he wants to check the hunt again grass and room will not spot this uh, fairly soon I I have to admit, so Count will happily hunt. On the other end, he is also converting the boars, I like this. He's converting the boars, he has free hunt in the back. I don't know if he will start... Uh, he got Plow, I don't know if he got Shadoof, we will see. 
um, Hyena checking on, in the right. So Count already forced uh, Grass and Groom to get into farms. He's probably got husbandry already. But on the other end, uh, Count is getting a lot of he a lot ahead. I think the score isn't telling the whole truth here because Count will get uh, the Shadoof upgrade, and by then he will be a lot ahead. He will have he has um, free hunt. Uh, he's going for an armory. I mean, he has a food to advance. The other side, the center is trying to go for some raiding. Where are the heroes? The heroes are sent back, but still, Count von Count is uh, getting. Uh, Kalispera, Teo, Kalispera. Welcome. Hronia Bola, Bedia, Hronia Bola. Count is uh, getting another. Uh, Kvoth, thanks so much for the follow, man. Welcome to the stream. Hope you have a good time. Uh, GG's nice win against Yoshi today. Uh, now we see that uh, Chef Hades, welcome. Thanks so much for the follow, guys. Hope you enjoy the stream. Grass and Groom also got the upgrade here, the plow. He got a villi in the expense of a centaur. I feel like this this centaur got a lot of value. Three villager kills. Um, on the other side now, Grass and Groom is going for those boars. I like this. Um, but Nethys is on the way already. 30%. Um, Grass and Groom is... Uh, he needs to get a house. I would like to see wall. A wall here at least to have this uh, gold mine kind of proxy secured uh he's going for some hippicon those hippicon will deny this hunt nice job from uh grassing room but i don't know how you defend against uh nearly nephthys probably he also said has the super migdal so he can drop a migdal right away with 300 gold on this spot and Grass and Groom cannot do anything about it. So, Nephthys uh, is through. And he's dropping a Mictal here. I don't know about this Mictal. I, sh I think he should build it here to protect both. He, he secures uh, the TC, the gold mine, the whatever that's left from the boars. On the other side, Grass and Groom is getting medium Hippicon. He's delaying uh, his heroic even further. Um, okay, this is a nice raid though. And uh, Count notices it right away. He's getting Shaft Mine. 46 to 53 Vils uh, to 45 Vils. And Grass and Groom is ahead in this number. But some spearmen wanted to harass with a scorpion man. I don't know uh, how Grass and Groom wants to defend against an ancestor's push. I will see. I would like to see Count throwing down. Oh, is he going for the forward TC or he's going to deny the TC? I think he's going for it with a pharaoh. Just three villagers. I don't know if they're enough. Apollo coming through from Grass and Groom. Okay, he's getting the forward TC, he wants to push. But on the other side, he's denied of this gold. He has a gold mine back here, which is... Um, ideal for him. Uh, come on, empower, empower. And we don't see any walls from Grassagroom. That gets me kind of skeptical about why leaving also this gold mine wide open. I mean, this gold mine is wide open by itself. Some walls maybe do the trick, but this is safer, in my opinion, my honest opinion. So, okay, we see that uh, Count is checking on this gold mine. On the other side, those Hippicons. Uh, Grass and Groom did a good job of not losing any single one of those six hips uh, raiding. And Count now... 
got the TC, got the forward TC. I would like to see some siege workshops being thrown down by the TC. So those ships and the Scorpio man, ah, oh, come on, get them back. Okay, he loses one of those. Maybe he will lose a second. And there's the siege works. So this is very close to the base of Crass and Groom. So this is Pandora's Boy, it's Pandora's Box tourney. Uh, this is the preliminary round. Winger goes to face Kimo, I feel like, I, um, in the round of 16. So this is a nice round, and the Ancestors being called in the back. Heracles is already out for Grass and Groom. Nice job. Uh, not any upgrades. Uh, the heroes are dying. And the Ancestors, I feel like they are wasted here. Not a good, uh, not a good cast of Ancestors. I mean, Grass and Groom is already mining on this gold mine on the right. I don't know what the plan is for Count right now. He didn't get any damage. He killed Odysseus and a couple of units, but Odysseus is still here. Uh, being trained right away. And uh, Grassing Room got the defense. So, yeah, sure. Count has the map control, got the fourth DC. The villager numbers are now equal and I would like to see Grass and Groom getting a mythicates timing push on the back DC with probably a couple of Colossi and the Underworld but at the same time look at this Count is going for the MIG tool he's going for the gold denial all the army on the one end forcing Grass and Groom to defend and on the other end, he's building the MGTOL. Really nice job. He's getting Shadoof right now. He will transition to farms after he has finished all this uh, hunt. He freely got all the hunt he could get. The chariots are going back. He's getting Copper Shields. Don't see any Toxotis from uh, Grass and Groom, so... I don't know why. Count is housed with four TCs. He is housed. Okay, those two houses didn't even get built at the start. So this is come. This comes back to hurt him a little bit because he's fighting forty pop at uh, twenty pop uh, under his cap. Okay, those ships. Get this uh, done. Grass and Groom is trying to advance to the Mythicades. I think Hyphaestus is the right choice. Uh, in this case, he needs a storehouse badly here. This is one of the most inefficient woodlines. Count on the other end. Yeah, you have three uh, lumber camps. Let's build three of them right away. Okay. 45 TCs. He will get up to. 180 pop. Grass and Groom's only hope is uh, Hephaestus. There it is 2% Hephaestus. Uh, Count is going full aggression in, in Heroic. And now there is. Um, Grass and Groom plays with time a little bit. He needs to get back. He needs to get some Toxotis or some Hypaspis going. I don't like the Hoplites. I like the Hypaspis option. High pass priest plus the Hippicon will give him uh, what he needs to defend against this uh, army composition from uh, Count von Count. On the other end, he is defending. Really good job from uh, Grass and Groom getting to defend uh, at three points and also securing this gold man. Oh, this. Okay, he's going for it. Never mind. So there is a 90 second delay for. Uh, Whoever uh, is interested in that. Okay. Units getting picked off right, left, and center. Grass and Groom doesn't mind so much losing some high pass priests, uh, having transitioned fully into farms. 16 plus 12, 28 farms are a lot. 
and uh, he fights as will be through. He has the oh now he's building the armories. He has the um, the favor to get it uh, to get the forge of Olympus right away. Okay, so where he will cast the plenty vault. He hasn't cast it yet. There it is. No Forge of Olympus yet, he doesn't have the resources, now he has a gold. Let's see, he needs a Colossus into the fight. Count on the other end, he's sitting at 80 villagers, 180 pop. He has a hundred population for army, <laughs> look at all those chariots, 21 chariots. This is a whole... Uh, all, all wood army. All his gold is going on the farms, he's just now um, getting the transition there. On the other side, this Colossus can really tank some damage from all those uh, units. And count... Oh, he's getting kite from uh, this Hippicon, nice micro from uh, Grass and Groom. Look at all those arrows firing on the Hippicon, look at Count's army being demolished here. He's losing all those units. And I feel like Grass and Groom has a, a good chance on this game. He's not getting Forge of Olympus yet, but he's managing to get Champion uh, Hippicon. He needs also medium and heavy infantry against those uh, spearmen. And he needs to push this before uh, Count gets into Mythic. Let's see if Count... Count doesn't have funeral rites yet. Um, Grassing Room sits at 130 pop still. I think he needs to train more Colossi. He needs to train uh, more High Passpies for sure. He needs to stop the Hoplites. Hoplites is not getting anywhere with Hoplites. And his resources are very thin. Uh, he's getting Shaftmine and Force of Olympus, trying to to get uh, some upgrades going, uh, getting his Seiko going. While on the other end, uh, Count is trying to solidify his position. I mean, those chariots just chilling in the background. A couple of Hippicons killing villagers. I, I really like this from Grass and Groom. He got two villies. Um... Count's gold mine is about to expire, only 1300 uh, left. Okay, quarry and irrigation on the other side. Some Helepolis uh, from uh, Grass and Groom. No medium. Uh, now medium infantry is coming through, but uh, I don't know. He has lost a lot of map control and he really needs to deny this MGTOL from going up. Priest without human right still. He has the resources to do it, but he's not doing it. Some martyrs. Uh, please don't fire on this. Uh, the Colossus will die. Helepolis will die. So this is a battle against time uh, for Grass and Groom. He has the first line of upgrades already. He's getting quarry. He's at Max Villis. But he needs to do something before Count gets upgrades or go Mythic. He's nowhere near Mythic, but you get my point. So let's see, another Helepolis and then... Why way forward Migdol while pushing on the TC? Uh, Count is playing this really well. Count is also... Pushing on this side, and this fortress is a little bit in the back. Ah, Grass and Groom is in a little bit of a tough spot. He needs to look at all the sell values for gold. Is already at 18, so Grass and Groom cannot really get any value out of trading gold. And he's not paying attention on the TC. Oh, now he, he noticed. Come on, come on, come on, save the DC, save the DC, we want to see a longer game. The DC will go down, and Grass has no 
answer now down to 120 pop count is already getting some mercenaries out as if 180 pop is not enough come on count Okay, some harassment in the back with those hippicons, but nothing too crazy. Those helepolis will do the job. He's also getting a tower push on this, and he's choking uh, Grass and Groom on this uh, side here. Helepolis is down, and the Spearman will also take care of this helepolis. I don't know, Grass and Groom is getting the second line of upgrades, but is it gonna be enough? This town center will be denied an, an armory? An armory. An armory, guys, a forward armory. I haven't seen that. Um, in five years of competitive play, I've never seen a, a forward armory. Anyway. Okay, second line of upgrades uh, researched for uh, Grass and Groom. He will take care of uh, those units, no question about that. Oh, those chariots are fighting on the storehouse, really nice for Grass and Groom now. He's uh, free to mine from this gold mine. He's buying some time, he probably will get this uh, town center. I think this is a mistake from Count. Letting grass getting get the TC back. Sixty one gold with empowerment. And grass and groom now starts to push off the chariots. I mean chariots against this army. I don't like this. I would like to see Scorpion Man maybe maybe some um, something else, not not pure chariots and not pure wood units as of now he's getting the push uh on the left okay this villager is all this oh no this villager lives with one hp without him even understanding what's going on that's hilarious okay andrew will pass it in the back yeah, but no seeds. Where are the seeds? Where are Colossi? Oh no, I don't like this. This is never gonna work. This is never going to work. He's getting also some villagers, but... I don't think this is the right play. Let, let him prove me wrong, but... I don't I don't see how Karas He's losing a lot of uh, units in the back he needs to build his storehouses. Come on Grass. Come on Grass. You need the resources man. This this is never go uh, maybe goes down nah, I don't this is never going down. This is never going down. There are ten ten villagers repairing but a lot of units dying for Grass and Groom. He's getting raided in the back. He ha He's down to 55 villagers. Just down to 55 villagers. Count is getting ahead by a lot now. This DC is never going down. Ah. Uh, one Colossi or one Helepolis. Okay, there it is. Maybe now it's going down. Maybe. Just maybe, but what's the follow-up? Grass Groom is down to 97 pop. There is no follow-up to this. No follow-up. Yeah. And Grass Groom resigns. G, G well played from uh, Count. Getting the first win over uh, Grass and Groom. Pure heroic. Pure heroic with Wood Army into 40 Cs. I mean, if Grass was able to take this TC down, I don't think Count would have any answer. Any answer. Because he will stick in Heroic forever. But still, still he has... This, this gold mine was not secured earlier. And this is very close to the TC. I think Grass and Groom needed to fortify this gold mine. What do you guys think? Anyway... 
we see very close KD and yeah Grass and Groom just need it to play with time a little bit longer or maybe fortify this area a little bit better anyway GG If you like the content, consider subscribing to my YouTube channel, also I stream often on Twitch, so if, uh, be sure to follow there. If you like the content even more, subscribe, it will be very supportive of me and continue my good work. As always, stay awesome guys, see you on Twitch.